most of the glyphosate is coming into our diet through the food we eat and not through the environment around us. There's a clear correlation between the use of this in agriculture and the level of exposure of the population. Many companies that are selling food, primarily in the food industry, not so much in the supplement industry, although that happens in the supplement industry too, it's more pervasive in the food industry, is they use these bastardized, uh, manipulated settings to prove that they are safe when in fact they aren't because they've changed the, the way that they're looking at it. It's just the way they do science. Most of these food labs are really working their primary customers, even though they're, in, quote, independent. Their primary customers are the big food companies. Mm -hmm. They don't want to embarrass them. They don't want to bring anything to the surface on that level. On average, a vegetable like spinach uh, that you buy, buy in an American, you know, American grocery store is going to contain or carry, on average, eight different pesticides. That's eight different pesticides, and you're taking it home to feed your family. The reassuring thing is that if you're, if you, uh, and we've had some people do this where they have a high level and they just say, okay, I'm going to change my diet. And mm -hmm. if they then go to a diet is, that's avoiding things that might contain uh, these chemicals, then within a week or two, they see significantly reduced levels of glyphosate. So you, it's a good measure for, or a good, good sort of um, way of, guiding what you're doing with your diet and, sure. and what you do. Yeah, and many times it's not, it's only theoretical or philosophical and you read about it and you hear about the concerns, but obviously the media is not exposing it. And most all conventional physicians are denying that it's an issue. So it's abstract, but when you get the numbers back from a lab and it's objective and you see it, it can be highly motivating. It definitely can. And we see people very often who are, they'll, they'll come back to us saying, oh yeah, this, this changed my way of thinking about my diet.